Hello everybody, it's me again, and we're back playing some more Feed and Grow Fish. Today's episode, I thought we might as well go ahead and play this guy, which we got in the last episode by sheer dumb luck. So, um, uh, you should probably go watch it back to see how we, uh, um, got it if you haven't seen it already. Basically, I was a Bibos, planned to end the episode with a bang, ended up, you know, Accidentally, somehow, rather, killing the Great White. Is this a sign of the apocalypse? I don't know, but it sure seems like it because I was probably the most surprised out of all of you. That sentence made no sense. Never mind. Uh, uh, anyway, so basically, this guy is an overpowered tank. Uh, he can eat anything, kill anything he wants, and without anything standing in his way, or giving him so much as a second thought, because they're dead before they can think. Uh, so as you can see, it's a terrorability of all of the other sharks. Does crazy damage, and then when you factor in the bite, <coughs> this guy has by itself, it is just, he's just like, what, 14 damage per second at level 1 more? Like, it's just crazy. Like, why would you even play anything else? I guess to make it less overpowered. But like, wh why is he so overpowered is what I meant by that. It's just, it's insane. I guess this guy is meant to be sort of the final boss in the game as of right now. Maybe we'll add something harder. But as of right now, this guy is looking to be the strongest by far of all the things in Feed and Grow Fish. I mean, look at that. Level 2, 559 health. If that's not a lot, I don't know what is. <laughs> but, uh, I, again, I have no idea how I successfully managed to kill him. Uh, but I did, so here we are. As a great white. Just because, now, because he kills everything instantly... He probably the video probably won't be just him because that'd be pretty boring. Uh, he just it, it just bite dead instantly. Not much too else to it. Grow big. It's just too easy at the great white. Nothing eats you. Nothing will ever touch you even come close to it. And it's just crazy overpowered. Hello, grouper. Haha, you're mine. Yum 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 yum. Mm, yummy. <laughs> Delicious. What do you move on? Oh, I'm stuck. How am I stuck? What? I can't move right now. So apparently the Great White is vulnerable to barrels, I think. Or is my keyboard glitching? Oh, it was my keyboard, sorry. Uh, the Great White is not vulnerable to barrels, it's just my keyboard. Keyboard. Gotta figure out a way to fix that. Still haven't fixed that, by the way. If you guys remember my keyboard glitches from way back when. This is not that far back. What was my last video, like, five months ago? Now I think about it, it is pretty far back. Delicious, slurp them all up. As you can see, you can slurp up all the teeny tiny fishes. Can I slurp up you yet? Oh, I can! I was I was about to say no, I can't, but I can. As you can see, already level six. Now, for such a big creature, he levels up pretty fast. You would not think he would level up this fast, but he does. I saw a swordfish? No, I don't think so. But I can swallow your bits. <laughs> Delicious. Yum. Oh, there's a gigantic bibos. You're mine. Yum. Oh, you're big too. Yum. Yum. Delicious. As you can see, crazy, crazy, crazy damage output. Don't know what the DPS in this guy is, but I can like I I can be sure it's insane. I don't actually know <laughs> very how to measure DPS very well. I just know that you do not want to be on the wrong end of this guy. Oh, I'll just snake that from the other great white. How big or much bigger are we than from you? Uh, not that much. Oh, you're dead. I no, I can't swallow you whole yet, but I can eat you like that. You level up significantly faster than the other great white though, as he doesn't want to eat this stuff, and you can. So, yeah. Yum 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 yes yummy yummy my tummy yum 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 One right ah, there's my next victim oh wait my mouse oh okay never mind 
You will all be in my tummy. Yum. Yum. And where are you? I lost you. I'll eat these two. Yum. Ah, disorientating. Yum. Oh, I missed. Yum. Yeah, so we're just gonna. That's basically again what this is. Just yum, 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 yum. Hey, don't you? Oh, and just slurping up zebra fish. Oh, tiger shark. Uh, I just ripped him. Did I just do 40 damage per second there? Let me check that. I need something like a sand hits for a few seconds. Like that glossy. Yeah. Let's check him. I'm level 14 now. 22, 22, 22. Oh my. Yum. Don't play with your food, Great White. Don't play with your food. Just eat it. Don't even think you have the brain power to play with your food. I don't think, anyway. How much brain power do you need to play with your food? Huh. Interesting question. I have a weird definition of interesting question, by the way. Alright guys, so I just hit level 30, um, and we have oh, 1,253 health, and what's our damage at? Let me find something that I can withstand us for two seconds, give me a second, uh, should be something down here, there you go, there's a big dragon, I, I still don't know what those things are called, can, 140 initially, wow. 140. That's not to mention what you do with like the shaking thing. Level 31. Yum, 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 yum. Ow! Mean old pufferfish. But as you can see, this guy is incredibly overpowered. Nothing can even touch you, really. Besides the occasional thing that accidentally bites you. But besides that. What the heck? Ah! Oh, you little bleeder. You little bleeding bleeder. Oh, I guess I, you're dead, so I don't know who I'm talking to, but how dare you? Also, well, I'm thinking about it, I apologize for the uh, terrible uh, quality and audio. Well, like it's not terrible, just poor quality and audio. For my last video, I'm currently in the process um, of testing or refiguring out what my setup was originally. Not so much my setup, just like how far away my microphone should be, how high its volume should be, um, you know, uh, what quality I can record at, just all that sort of stuff. Uh, so I apologize for that in the last video, and I apologize again if it's still pretty bad in this video. Uh, but not much, I, I, well, I guess there is stuff I can do about that, but I'm just still trying to figure out what I can and can't do with uh, my computer right now. All right, guys, so I'm becoming another fish just because I don't think I can do entertain on a whole episode of the Great White just because, oh, ah, spawn inside a wall. How does that even work? So basically, you go around poking things and avoiding, although actually the Great White won't anchor to me at this stage, so I don't really have to worry about that. So basically, you just go and, oh, he won't. So like this uh, thing right here, I can just poke him. Let me poke you. Oh, let me poke you. Let me... Oh, come on. Let me poke you. Stand still, will ya? Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. Poked. You just got poked by my nose. My sharp, pointy nose. There you are. Come back here. I'm not done with you yet. Aw. Come back here. Poke. And poke. And... Aw. Poke. Ah, no! No! Oh, wait, I'm okay. I should be... Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm a bit bruised and battered. Got wounds on my sides, but... Deep wounds on my side, but I'm okay. Ah, another one! I can't take another one! I can't take another one! But as you can see, the sword on the swordfish's nose does quite a lot of damage. It's... And is pretty powerful. Also, watch this. It sort of like breaks up food as you're eating it because it sort of rams it into your own nose somehow. Yum, yum, yum. Let's stir up all of my uh, past remains. So now it'd be weird that you're eating your, pa your past self's remains. Does it ever strike you as like a bit freaky and weird? Not until now. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, but I never explained how the mechanics worked of the swordfish. So basically, the faster you have, like, the little surny nose, and the faster you're going when you poke your nose into something, the more damage it will do. And then sort of, the, the, this guy, whoa, you're big. Wait, no, you're not. And as you can see, yeah, it does a, quite a bit of damage. And it's, it kind of specializes in hit and run attacks. We'll see if I can demonstrate it properly on this Dunkleosteus. This isn't the best spot for it. So now, as you can see, hit him a couple times. Now I'm getting out of here before he chomps me. Oh, you want to go, buddy? Don't do nearly as much damage as you, but that initial sword swipe does a lot. Uh, so that's basically what you want to do, is that if you're against a strong opponent, using hit and run attacks is generally your best strategy. It's probably better if I just do this. Like that. Like so. Yum, 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 yum. Now we just go for another stab. You, can I lure you out here where you get out where it's safer? Ah, don't eat me. No. Don't eat me. You know what? Screw it. I'm just going in. Stab. Oh, no. No. Oh, 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 oh. That was stupid. I shouldn't have done that. But now I can just demonstrate it properly. Don't even need to sprint into him. Fortunately, Dunkleosteus takes so long to bite down that it's a lot safer than what it could be. <gasps> that was too close. Don't don't use your stamina when you do this, by the way. That way you can just charge away. So now we just run away. It's like so. These guys lose aggro pretty fast. So now then. Oh, that was too close. I, I didn't even get hit off him. I was just too scared. And we just go. Ah, I missed again. Dang it. And then we just go... Ah! Okay, now wait. Wait till he lets go. Now sprint. Wait, wait, wait. Now sprint off. You see what I mean? It's not that hard to get away from them. Significantly easier than what other things of you that have, like, a better bite. Now we just keep doing this until we get him down low enough. And then another 36 damage. And now then, another third, and he's dead. So that's basically what you do. Don't use dare steal my kill, Tiger Shark. Go away, Tiger Shark. You will not be stealing my kill. It's a kill thief. Go away. I just killed Uncle Osteus. Go away. Here we go, 35, 35. And now we just kill him. I hope I can do this. I should be able to. Yeah, yeah, I just killed him. I let the carcass go. The Dunkleosteus. There you are. Now we just go stab. Stab. Just break up. Oh, there we go. So now we just eat all this. Nom, 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 nom. Get up high to a higher level again. So that's basically what this guy does. He specializes in hit and run attacks. Um, because it doesn't do much upfront damage, but that nose does quite a bit of damage without you having to, like, stay there and bite for a few seconds. Where did that tiger shark carcass go now? Yeah, I gotta get better to keep track of these. There it is. Yum. Or I guess poke. Poke. Yeah, my pokes. Poked him to I poked him out. Can I eat these whole now? Yes, I can, I think. Level up. We are now level 16 at full health. By the way, if you eat, you regen faster. Eating regens up, um, speeds up regen. Pretty sure everyone knew that, but I only found out recently, so that's to be expected. We are talking about me here. So now then, just continuously poke back again. Ah, no! Now just wait till he stops biting. And just swim away like that, like that. No, you just... Is he dead? No, he's not dead. I thought he might be dead for a second. So now we're, then we just come in for a poke. And poke. Run away. So basically, you just keep doing this over and over again until I can find him again. Where did he even go? What the heck? See what I mean? I am terrible at keeping track of these things. Uh, how did I lose a gigantic fish? Oh, was that him? Might be a different one, but I'll take it. Ah, uh, 
Oh no, turn around. Turn around when he lets go. Swim away. There we go. See, not that hard. But where did the other one go? Don't think that's the same one. Maybe it is. I don't know. Oh, there's a shark. We want to avoid that, uh, the great white. We want to avoid him. So that's basically what the idea was. This guy just poke everything until it dies. Oh, that's a great white. Run away. Run away. Okay, I thought that was Dunglossius, and I almost just killed myself there. 10 out of 10. Oh, um, for almost just killing yourself. Uh, now, what do we move on to? What's to eat that is delicious around here? You know what? Uh, I'm not quite going to end the episode yet. I was about to say, let's see if we can kill the Great White again with the Swordfish this time. But I'm not quite ready to end it. Let's see if we can kill one more Dunkelostius first. Anything? Ah, he's after me! Ah! 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 Again, I'm sorry if I broke when this jumps out. <sighs> well, that's it for this episode, guys. Bye. Have a good day, and don't forget to subscribe and put a like on this video, and bye. See ya. Have a good day. Bye. See ya.